Hey guys, I am back, and I have another sneak review. I just realized I haven't did a sneak review in like a month, which I apologize because I really didn't mean to take that long, but you know what, I'm lying to you. It's not even a review. I'm just going to show you something that I recently got. So it's more like a recent cop type of video. Um, Rasta clots on my wrist. Yeah, I'll let you guys see that. I have my Rasta clots on. Um, if you're smart and you've seen the color of my Rasta clots, you would probably assume that the shoes I'm about to show you are black and green, or somehow, some way, close to those colors. I got these shoes, I want to say maybe two and a half weeks ago. I'm not too sure, but I had them for a while. I even recorded like a whole video showing them, and then I realized I wore my glasses during the video, so you could see like a really big glare, and it just looked really, really weird, so I never showed that. But, um, yeah, so, that's why you haven't got the video yet. But... I am here now, and I'm going to make it all okay. I'm going to show you the shoes. I don't remember the actual release date on these. I don't know when they came out. Um, I found out about them, I want to say, at the beginning of this year. Yeah, like pretty close to the beginning of this year, I've seen them. Um, they're Jeremy Scott's. I usually don't really pay attention to Adidas too much. And then I seen, um, I started seeing more Jeremy Scott's, and I'm like, oh, okay, I kind of like those. When those, like, Cheetah, Leopard, whatever they are, those ones came out. I had, I had gotten those, and that's when I started, like, really seeing a whole bunch more. So, um, I had seen this pair, and I really wanted them, but I'm like, okay, they then came out, I'm never gonna get them. Whatever, I totally forgot about them. So, about a month ago, I was in Miami, and I was at a club with a few of my friends, and one of the boys who was with us, he was wearing them, and I was like, damn, now I really want those, especially that I see them in person. So now, fast forward a few days, probably like a week, fast forward like a week, and... I'm at the Tampa DXC. If you guys don't know what DXC is, it's a dunk exchange. Um, my friend Jen Two Stacks, she holds them in Florida, so I'm always at dunk exchanges because of her supporting her and everything. This was actually the first dunk exchange I actually bought something, because every other dunk exchange, stuff in my size, is like stuff I have. So, I never like, want to buy stuff I have. And it, I wasn't even going to buy them. I was just looking at them for a while, and I was talking to my friends, and we're like, looking at them, and I'm like, yeah, I really want them. I don't even want to know what size they are. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. So, of course... I go up to the boy and I'm like, so, what size are those? And he goes, size 6. I was like, oh man, what do I do? So I ended up buying them. I was trying to be good and not spend any money, but that didn't happen. So I end up buying them and I will finally show you what the shoes are. To build anticipation, here is the box. Ooh, showing you every side but the front that says the name. Now, I got the Camo Jeremy Scotts. These are probably one of the toughest shoes I feel like I own because they're sick. I love camo. Um, camo's really in right now, too. I'm always seeing girls wear camo, but I really don't care what they wear. It's all about what I like, and I love these. So, I got these. Um, they got the neon inside. If I do wear them, which I'm probably going to wear them once or twice, I'll, I'll explain why I'm not going to really wear them too much in a minute, but if I do wear them, chances are I'm going to put neon laces in them just because I want to stand out and be like, oh, I'm in your face, all in your face, like that. So, I'll give you guys a better look at them. Got the wings on them. When I see guys wearing them, I've seen them both ways. I've seen guys wear them with the wing, and then I've seen guys wear them without the wing. Um... If you're a grown man and you're wearing the wings on your shoes, I don't really know how I feel about it too much. I have to, like, see your style and what you're wearing with it. But, um, for the most part, I see grown men with the wings off. And, um, I don't know. I feel like it kind of takes away from the shoe. Imagine it with the wing off. Still cool, but it takes away from the shoe. So if I wear them, it's going to most likely be with the wing. Yeah, probably. Now, why I said I'd probably only wear them once or twice, I would just wear them just to, like, show I have them is because they suck. They are so uncomfortable. I tried them on after I bought them, and I wanted to just, like, chop my feet off. They are the most uncomfortable sneakers in the world. I don't know if it's just me or what, but, um, my boy, Just for Kicks 212 if you guys watch his videos, you know he knows, like, all about shoes and what's inside and junk. When I tried them on, I, I went to him, I'm like, yo, these suck. They're so uncomfortable. And he told me, he was like, yeah, would you expect something? They're made out of something. I don't know. But they feel just like plastic on the inside, and that's not so fun. But other than that, I love the shoes. They're tough to me. Um, you got the Adidas symbol in the back. You got Adidas up here. You got Jeremy Scott inside. It says New York, Paris, Beverly Hills. 
try to show you guys that. Adidas on the bottom, Adidas on the side. Okay, Adidas really made sure you know that these are Adidas, like no games. Okay, these have the three stripes on the side, and they say Jeremy Scott over here. I would give you all the tech info, but I really don't know Adidas like that, so I don't want to say it and then screw it up. So, I'm just not going to do that. Yeah, so that's pretty much it with these. Like I said, it, it took me some time, but I was patient, and I ended up finding them, which is always the best when you just kind of like walk into stuff. And they were my first pair of sneakers that I ever bought at a DXC, which is about time because I've been to enough of them. I suggest, if you have these, that you don't wear anything camo, because that's kind of weird when you're wearing like camo up top and then camo on your feet. I personally wouldn't do it. I don't know how it will look on you. That's a little bit too much to me, but to each his own. But like I said, I definitely want to throw in neon laces and see how that's going to look. I'll put them on. I'll show you how they look. I'll walk around, all that great stuff. And let me know your opinion on them. Let me know if you would get them, if you have them. And let me know what you wear them with. If you, have, if you guys have them and you have any pictures, tag me on Instagram and your pictures. I want to see what you wear them with. I want to see how they look before I wear mine. I forgot to tell you guys that the pair that I got is dead stock and I paid 200 So I paid retail without tax and I got them brand new. So at the end of the day, I feel like that was a complete win-win for me. And I don't know, I'm happy with it. So there's really no complaints here. Alright, see you guys later.